This is my wife, Andrea, and as long as I've known her, she's had this knack for taking old outdated things and turning them into something beautiful. So after seeing this about a thousand times, I took it upon myself to make her a channel because she wouldn't do it herself. And so now I'm super excited to share with you the creative adventures of my DIY wife. Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Dean and Andrea, and today we're bringing you a really special furniture flip. Yeah, we actually had some friends of ours approach us and ask if we'd be willing to do a piece for them as a commission piece. They were looking for a piece with a little more farmhouse style to it. Not something I typically get to do, but they gave me total creative freedom to add my own personal style and take on that look. So not to give it away, but I really love the way this piece turned out. And with that, let's jump into the build laps.
Today, for the first time on this channel, I'm going to be using this Fusion Mineral Paint. I couldn't find the exact color I wanted, so I ended up mixing two colors in a 50-50 ratio. Now, 99% of the time, I will tell you to prime your furniture, but since this paint bonds so well, and I wasn't really worried about tannin bleed through since this is a solid maple dresser, I was able to skip the priming. I did go ahead and spray a primer on the areas where I had sanded down to the bare wood, just to give better coverage there. Fusion Mineral Paint also has a built-in top coat, so unless I'm using it on something like a tabletop or something that's going to be getting a lot of wear and tear, I don't worry about the top coat either. So I applied three good coats and ended up with a durable, beautiful finish. I mean, wow, this thing just looks so elegant. It looks regal. I don't even know quite how to describe it, but it looks so good. Yeah, it really does feel like a more sophisticated take on the traditional farmhouse style, and I love how it turned out. 
So as usual, let's talk about the numbers behind this dresser. I actually got this dresser as part of an entire bedroom set that came with two twin beds, two dressers, and a nightstand. I paid $250 for the whole set, but then turned right around and sold the two beds for $180. So we said this piece cost us about $40, and that's on the generous side. I spent a little more on materials than I typically do, and my total material cost came out to be about $100. And that's partly because I knew who we were making this for, and I had something very specific in mind that I wanted to do for them. We gave them a finished price of $500 for this dress, giving us a profit of 360 on it. So that's it for this video. I just love the way this piece turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as we did. And if you are enjoying these flips, then definitely stick around because of course we have another video coming up very soon. It's really special. It's so special, huh? Yeah, we actually had some friends of ours ask us to do to to do is hard to say. To do. To do. I had something very specific in mind that I wanted to do for them. We love you, Clark and Paul. <laughs> that was a great line. Is that okay? What a great line. Okay. <laughs>